Hey everyone and welcome back to Final Fantasy VII Remake. On this video, we're completing Chapter 9, The Town That Never Sleeps. So, we need to return to Madame M's to pick up Aerith. Check in on Aerith, yes. No! Cloud! Finally! <sighs> Tifa! She... I... Tifa! She, she's... I don't... Take a deep breath. What about Tifa? I heard Corneo was gonna audition new girls soon. And Tifa's... Tifa's gonna be... I just... I, I don't know what to do. Well, I do. I'll come too! Hey, Cloud! Bro, I can call you bro, right? Nope. Just wanna say, bro, that I'm totally relieved that you're looking out for Tifa. Call themselves... So, like, how'd you get so strong anyway, bro? I said... The way you fight, bro, is like poetry and violence. Bam, bam, whoosh, whoosh, you know? I really wish I could be just like you. Well, this is it for me. Call me crazy, but, uh... I have a feeling that I'll just be getting in the way. Go find Aerith at Madame Mims. Tell her to wait for me there when she's done. Think you can handle that? Yes, sir! Let's do this. Break her out. I'm gonna tear through all you guys like butter. again got a letter of approval right here hmm? you know that's only good for women right yeah it's for Aerith who oh that girl you were with sorry to hear that well either way you're stuck out here pal I can't let you in I wasn't asking for permission huh? wouldn't try it if I were you trust me you don't want to screw with the Don if you even think about causing any trouble, he'll make sure someone pays for it. And that someone might wind up being the girl you're trying so hard to break out. Or it could wind up being someone you've never even met before. Get it? You're in the Don's world now. Anyway, you've got some time yet. The audition won't start for a while. If you're sure you want to go through with this, then bring the girl and the letter. But if I were you, I wouldn't. All right, well, the plan to bust some heads has been diverted. Gaudy and impossible to move in. Uh, uh, yeah. Cloud? Uh, uh, excuse me. Huh. Hey, wait a minute. Did Johnny forget to give you my message? The one asking me to stay put? No, I got it. I was worried about you. I'm starting to think this place is more dangerous than we thought. Who knows what they'll ask you to do in this audition. No way in hell I'll let you go in there by yourself. By myself? Oh, don't worry. I wasn't gonna. Come on, you'll see. See what, exactly? According to Madam M, you've caught the eye of a certain fabulous someone, 
and they'd like to meet in person. Huh? What you talking about, Aerith? Well, I'm following her. Look at you all dolled up and fabulous. Well, what do we have here? You're quite the pretty little lady. Not quite sure how she's running in that dress with those heels, but she's not bad at all. Impressive. What's up, Chadley? Hey there, cutie. Where are you headed? Oh, why don't you let me buy you a cup of I coffee? I now isn't the best time to discuss my research. Find me again when you have a moment. All right, fine. Why are we here? To see the honeybee inns Andrea Rodea and convince him to give you his stamp of approval. You said you didn't want me going alone, right? Well, with Andrea's help, you can join me. It'll be fun. And honestly, I think you'll look pretty cute in a dress. What? It's pretty rare for Andrea to take a personal interest in someone. At least, that's what Madame M said. Trust me, this is gonna work out great. Uh... Come on! Don't you want to save Tifa? Wait. No can do, Cloud. This is our plan, and you'll learn to love it. So, here's how I think we should approach him. Madame M said Andrea was a man who'd give anyone a fair chance to win him over. So I say we march right up to him, explain the situation, and see where that gets us. Sound good? Uh, I guess so. Good evening. Welcome to the entertainment extravaganza that is the Honeybee Inn. We're here to see Andrea Rodea. You must be Mr. Cloud. He's waiting for you. Mr. Cloud? I've been instructed to send you through without delay, sir. Please, make your way to the stage in the back. What stage? The one in the back, sir. Straight through those doors and down the hall. Head to the stage, yes. Skip the practice session, yes. Come on, come on, the show's about to start. Oh. <laughs> my, my, is that Cloud? Mm. Darling, I had no idea. <laughs> you? Well, you just sit tight until Andrea takes the stage. Look at his muscles. Ah, oh, he's flushing.
But those who crave my favor must first prove that they know how to move. Follow my lead. Yes, I will transform you into a vision of beauty. Now, without further ado, let us begin! Thank <laughs> you. 
True beauty is an expression of the heart, a thing without shame, to which notions of gender don't apply. Don't ever be afraid to Today blew my mind. Hey, look at me! I could dance too. How much did you drink Just tonight? Come over I here. can't help it. It was amazing. Drink. We can talk. Was it planned oh, from the start? Well, probably not. Now did that was a show. Like a surprise. Hey, Cloud, get back here. Mm -hmm. Cloud. Don't be ashamed, Cloud. You look pretty. Mm. Please don't. Not a word. Not even one? No! But, but one you're so such pretty! From a fall. Oh boy. Alright, we've got our costume. Let's get over to the dons, get this over with. I suppose on the way we could talk to Chad. Forgive me, miss, but the way you're staring at me is rather... Oh, oh goodness! Who I'm is experiencing she? I need to learn everything response. about her. What is this emotional response? Poor Chadley. Little did he know, it was Cloud! Whoa! She is the most beautiful girl in the world. Wait a minute! Whoa, that is one hot chick. Okay, we made it back. Away from the crowds. Good. from Andrea Rodea and Madam M. That ought to do the trick, right? You serious? Is there a problem? I hope you know what you're in for. Oh, we'll be fine. If you say so, come on. See, he's smarter. He recognized Cloud right away. Just saying. The two of you here for the audition? Second floor, at the very end of the walk. And don't go poking your nose in where it doesn't belong. That one's Madam M's girl, ain't it? Man, she's not. That Andrea's girl? I'd let her do things to me. Room's at the end. Keep walking. So dizzy. Gas. Uh, uh. Come on. Damn it. Cloud. Good. 
Wait a minute. <gasps> Cloud? Is that you? Oh my god, that makeup! And that dress! Nailed it, I know, thank you. Moving on. <sighs> you good? Yeah, bit woozy, but I'll manage. <sighs> hey, Tifa, how you doing? Uh, okay. Oh, right. I'm Aerith, a friend of Cloud's. We were worried and thought we'd come help you out. Uh, thanks? Cut the chatter. We gotta leave. Huh? Right now. Uh, no, not until I got what I came for. What? So, after we made it back to the slums, some guys came around asking all kinds of questions. So I did some digging. And found out they were Corneo's men. Right. They were interested in Avalanche. But I couldn't figure out why. So I thought I'd come and ask the man himself. Seriously? Thought if I could find a way in and get some one-on-one -on -one time, but then I realized I'd only be one of three candidates, and that if he didn't pick me, it would all be for nothing. Then your worries are over, aren't they? Because the other two candidates are right here, right? Uh, right. So yeah, if we're all in on it, then nothing can go wrong. Uh, I guess not. You? Me? Cloud? Makes no difference who gets chosen, does it? I don't know, Aerith. It feels wrong getting you involved in all this. Don't even bother trying to talk her out of it. Oh, Cloud gets me. Took you long enough. <sighs> we found Tifa! So what happens now? I think they'll call for us when it's time. This room gives me the creeps. Well, it should give you the creeps. It's got like torture devices. No? Uh, okay. Now, ladies, listen up. I'm sure you're still feeling a bit woozy, but tonight's audition's about to begin. Head out the door to the left and up the stairs. Come on, ladies, let's hustle. All right, guys. Let's do this. <laughs> do you want to do this? Let's go. Get out of this creepy looking dungeon. Beautiful ladies, time to line up for the dawn. <sighs> Wait, you look kind of familiar. We haven't met before, have we? Mm -mm. Uh, whatever. All right, y'all good to go? Then let's do this thing. Introducing Walmart's most eligible bachelor, the one and only Da Corneo. Ladies? Uh. Nice. Very nice. <laughs> Whichever one shall I pick? Mm. Oh. Shall I pick you? <laughs> or maybe you? Yeah. And tomorrow's, or the day after's, if the dawn takes a shine to you. Pathetic. Huh? Hey, which one of you said that? Was it you? Ooh, you got a mouth on you! 
I'm going to enjoy breaking it in. Today's lucky lady is the Big Bone Girl. Huh? Still playing hard to get? I can dig it. Oh, yeah. The leftovers are all yours. Yeah! yeah. We. Okay! Okay, lady. Y'all coming with me. Don't be shy, little kitten. Shimmy on over and give Daddy some sugar. No need to play coy. Nobody here but you and me. Oh, you're even cuter than I thought. Back off. Ooh! <laughs> this kitten's got claws! I love it! <laughs> what was that? Don't you worry, your pretty little head. Just a picture to preserve the moment. And to ensure you don't do anything inappropriate like say no. Asshole. Oh, praise me more! <laughs> hey, yo, fellas! We got guests, and y'all got first crack at entertaining them. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Courtesy of the ever generous Don Corneo himself, never forget the Don provides. Yeah. So, ladies, ready to get to it? Yeah. I guess I'm good to go whenever. How about you, Tifa? Mm. Four guys between us. Okay, let's not keep Cloud waiting. Right. Wait. I know you. The Coliseum! <laughs> what the hell? Get down! <laughs> Good job, Eric. It was nothing compared to you. <laughs> Andrea filled me in on the situation. I come bearing gifts with gear. I'll do what I can to clean this up. Just finish the job. Uh, thank you! Okay, let's go rescue Cloud. Corneo's room, right? Alright, before we continue... How is Materia? Materia's real bad. Alright, so we gotta fix this. HP absorption with lightning. That seems okay. Elemental with fire. Uh, let me switch these, actually. There we go. So, fire on the weapon. HP absorption with the lightning still. Magnify with healing. That's fine. HP up, MP up. Magic up. Seems good. Tifa, however, is in... She's uh, got a mess here. Oh, and I put Deadly Dodge in there, which I did not mean to do. I don't even know what it was. Uh, but I don't really want any of this, to be honest, so get rid of that. Uh, let's see. What can we do for Tifa? We already took that elemental, so we don't have that. Oh, I don't know. I guess we could level another HP absorb. Oh, actually, you know what we can do? Let's actually tie Eris Lightning Materia to this, uh, what's it called? The MP Absorption. I want to try this out. All right, and then Tifa can take the better HP Absorption and tie that to something. I don't know what yet. Ice, maybe? Let's, let's make it ice. All right, and then, oh geez, what else do we want on her? ATB Stagger for sure. Steadfast Block's a good one. Let's give her the ability to heal, maybe with a prayer. Let's give her that pray and she can level it up a bit. And what else do we have? We already gave her Steadfast Block and ATB Stagger. I guess we could give her a first strike. 
Although the first strike would probably be better on Aerith, but oh well. Uh, we'll give her a luck up. And I guess we could level up. Oh, I should give her HP up for sure. So HP up, and the final one will be... Uh, you know what? Let me give her a barrier. I think that's a good one for her to hang on to. So, take that, I guess. Cool. That seems good to me. Oh, wait. No, we didn't give her an MP up, did we? We should probably be leveling those. All right, whatever. We don't need the barrier. We'll give her MP up. All the way down. Yeah, that one doesn't have any progress on it. Well, I guess that one. Okay. And what about upgrades to weapons? Tifa has 46 points to spend. And a new core is revealed. What do we got on that core? Ooh, attack power twice and new materia slots. All right, well, let's get a new materia slot. So we can get one more materia in there. I guess I'll put a barrier. Uh, and then two attack powers? Nope, can just get the one. All right, so the other one's gonna have to wait. Although it doesn't necessarily have to be a barrier. But anyways, that's good enough for now. Materia and equipment. Let's go barrier for now, I suppose. Do that. Okay. And then Aerith has 30 points. Although I don't know if I actually need anything with her. Oh, well, we do have the new materia slot. I guess I may as well pick that up. That I'll be using all these connections, but they're there if I need them. We can get 20% boost to magic with full MP. Oh, no, we can't. We need two more SP for that. So, that's it. Alright. I believe we are ready. Better hurry. Thanks, buddy. Man, I love this place. She's quality tired. Like that. Bet they're going at it right now. Lucky bastard. Alright, we don't need to mess with those guys, we'll just ignore them. What are you doing here? These guys not so lucky. Rejects? Rejects? How dare you? That's Who's the reject now? Tell me what you a bad boy I bastard. am! <laughs> yes, yes I am! Here I come, baby! <laughs> <laughs> hey, who the hell gave you permission to do that? One of you get in here and teach this bitch some manners! Sorry, but your boys had to learn some manners too. What the? Cloud, you're close! <laughs> oh. 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 So you're a man, huh? What are you three up to? We'll ask the questions. Like, why'd you have men in Sector 7 asking about Avalanche? Man. Huh? Don't know what you're talking about. Don't play dumb with me. Let's try again. Why did you have men in Sector 7 asking about Avalanche? Spill the beans, or... I'll cut them off. All right, all right! I'll talk, I'll talk! <sighs> uh, some guy with a gun for an arm! I was paid to find him! Paid by who? I can't tell you that! They'd hunt me down like a dog! Well, you better. Cause if you don't, I'll rip them off! <laughs> mm. 
It was the director of public security, Heidegger! It was Heidegger! Shinra! And what were they planning? Some things are better left unsaid, you know? See, I'm not so sure they are. Better keep talking. Or I'll smash them. <laughs> All right, you got me. I could never say no to a sexy girl. Since Avalanche blew up two reactors, Shinra's decided they ought to stamp them out, home base and all. And I mean, stamp out. By targeting the support pillar and blowing it up. The pillar? Did I stutter? The plate will come crushing down. It'll be Sector 6 all over again. I'm sure you've been there and seen the wreckage for yourself. So you know exactly what Sector 7 is gonna look like. They wouldn't. Come on, guys. We gotta go. Before you do... No. Please, this won't take long. As everyone knows, villains only divulge their plans in a certain situation. But what is that situation? Hmm. <laughs> when they think they've already won. When they think they've already won. Right? Ladies and gentlemen, we have ourselves a winner! You get an all-expenses-paid trip to the sewers. <laughs> 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 Enjoy the sights and smells! <laughs> and that concludes Chapter 9. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.